Ever wanted to pick up girls at conventions? Well, cosplay is not consent. Today, Tiffany gives you the rundown on how to talk to cosplayers and not come off like a creeper. This episode is brought to you by DX Racer, the ultimate seat of choice to heighten your gaming experience. Are you going to a convention and need to know a little bit of cosplay etiquette regarding the ladies? Today, we go over the do's and don'ts of picking up cosplayers at conventions, and how to overall not be a creepy dude to some of the cosplay ladies, or ladies to the guys. I see how some of you ladies go for those 300 cosplayers. I see. First, we need a girl in cosplay. Here we have Brittany dressed as Rogue. And now we need a fanboy with a camera. Let's first go over some different scenarios and what to do and not to do with cosplayers. First, taking photos of a cosplayer when she has no idea you're taking photos. Rogue is over here talking with her friend and well, there goes fanboy Mike taking pictures of her completely weirding her out. Sorry, fanboy Mike, but this is something you shouldn't do. Instead, go up to the cosplayer and ask her if you can take her picture. She'll be excited that you asked and she'll be able to give you an awesome pose. Next, the walk by cat call. All the ladies experience this when there's a guy calling out, hey, hot rogue, stop, I need to show my guy friends this. Oh my God, you look really hot. Instead, try this. Wow, Rogue, you look really great in that costume. Can I please get a picture? Remember, the cosplayer worked on this costume and hey, if she bought it, she at least got into it. So she deserves your respect. Last, the glomp. If you guys don't know what this is, it's a really awkward, overemphasized hug that is all in your personal space. I can't emphasize that enough. This is when a fanboy pretty much lets it all go and screams and yells, Hey, can I hug you? And run up to the cosplayer. Instead, how about you get a photo with the cosplayer? Just ask her, hey, can I get a photo with you? Are you feeling confident? Did you do all the right things and not scare off the cosplayer? Well, good for you. But there are a couple other things you should probably look out for. First of all, look and see if there's a boy standing around holding all of her stuff. That's her boyfriend, stop hitting on her. Right after she took a photo with you, did she kind of run away really quickly with her friends? That happened, she's not interested. Sorry, sweetie. So what is the most important thing to do when you're flirting with a cosplayer? Just be yourself, just talk to her, and maybe you two can start connecting on the character that you both seem to love. Expand that and talk about genres, talk about new shows or new comics. Maybe there's even more for the two of you to talk about. How do you continue the conversation past the convention floor? Ask if maybe the two of you can hang out in the dealer's room. Maybe check out a panel or an autograph session. Or even better, see if the two of you can go out for food at the courtyard. All that being said, if she's a cool cosplay chick, she'll hang out with you, no problem at all. If she's kind of snobbish and kind of turns you down, you probably didn't want her anyway, sweetie. So I hope a couple of these things help you talk to cosplayers at your next convention. Remember, we're people too. We're relaxed, we're cool chicks. Most of us are cool chicks. Till next week, leave me comments down below. Check out the linkies, linkies. Go check out the linkies, bye. Ever wanted to pick up girls at conventions? Well, please stop. <laughs> Impulse is produced by the Freedom Network. Ever wanted to earn revenue from your videos? Freedom offers a great partnership program which includes access to hundreds of thousands of audio tracks, sponsorships with great partners, and most importantly, a no lock-in contract. You can leave at any time for any reason. We accept everyone, both big and small. For more information, click here or visit the link in the video description.